wasn't long, was I? Not at all, Miss Jacobson. I sure hope you've got my face on straight. It looks perfect for my money. Won't you sit down, Mr. Neff, was it? With two Fs, like in Philadelphia, if you know the story. What story? The Philadelphia story. I'm sorry, what were we talking about? About the insurance. My husband never showed me anything. Yes, uh, it's on your two cars, the LaSalle and the Plymouth. We've been covering your husband for three years now. That's a honey of an anklet you're wearing there. We'd hate to see these policies lapse, of course. You give them 30 days and that's all we're allowed to give. Oh, he must be busy down in Long Beach in the oil fields. Could I catch him here at home sometime? Well, he's usually not home much before eight. Well, that would be all right with me. Are you associated with the Automobile Club? No, the all risks, Miss Dijkson. Why? Somebody at the Automobile Club's been trying to get him. Did they have a better rate? If your husband's a member. No, he isn't. Well, he'd have to join and pay a membership fee to start with. The Automobile Club is fine. I'm not one to knock the other man's merchandise, of course. But I can do just as well for you. I have a very attractive policy here. It wouldn't take me two minutes to put it in front of your husband. You're a smart insurance man, aren't you, Mr. Neff? I've had 11 years of it. Any good? It's a living. And you cover just automobile insurance or all kinds? All kinds. Uh, fire, theft, earthquake, public liability, industrial stuff, and so on right down the line. Accident insurance? Accident insurance. Sure, Mr. Hutchinson. I wish you would tell me what's engraved on that anklet. Just my name. As for instance, Phyllis. Phyllis. I think I like that. So you're not sure? Well, I'd have to drive it around the block a few times. Why don't you come in tomorrow around 8.30? He should be in then. Who? My husband. You were anxious to speak with him, weren't you? Oh, yes, but I'm getting over it now, if you know what I mean. Well, there's a speed limit in this town, Mr. Neff. 45 miles an hour. How fast was I going, officer? I'd say about 90. Suppose you get down off your motorcycle and give me a ticket. Suppose I let you off the warning this time. Suppose it doesn't take. Suppose I whack you over the knuckles. Suppose I burst out crying and put my head on your shoulder. Suppose you try putting it on my husband's shoulder. That tears it. 8.30 then tomorrow evening, Miss Dedrickson. What I suggested. 